Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and I, I just did a, a video on drawing an ellipse, holding down the shift and the control button. Then I started thinking, well, I, I should have shown that that can do any shape, a square, polygon, but more importantly, these lines are in the center. The old age, age old problem of finding the center of a star and big, making the star in the center, if you put it on that center of the page and grow it out, that is the center of the star. Now, look where Corel puts the star when I hit the letter P to put it in the center of the page. Corel does that, and that's, there's no way around it because that is between, you know, that X is between the, the outer nodes. But that's not correct. I mean, if you wanted to make it the star that center, and I've done many videos on that, you could always draw a six-sided star, hit P, and then turn it back to a five-sided star, and then that is in the center of the page right here, not where Corel thinks it is, because if we, it doesn't look like it is, but the distance between every one of those lines is the same distance if we look, you know, go from that node to that center, that center to that node, that center to that center. And if you did this from the center of the page normally, that wouldn't look like that. You wouldn't have equal sections. So when you want to draw a, uh, anything, if you like we had in the other video, if you want a star on the end of that page or end of that line, just hold down the shift and the control button and it's going to be there for you. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.